so let's start with the class blueprint, right? And here we need to talk about a little bit of programming terminology. Uh, Unreal Engine uses what is called object-oriented programming. And in this uh, object-oriented uh, framework, the class blueprint would be co considered an object. What is an object? An object is something that encapsulates information and functionality, right? For example, if I needed to, to have a car in the game, maybe I can create it as a, an object, right? Because I want to use it more than once and have more than one car, I could create an object called car. Or well, a vehicle. Because maybe my game designer is really not sure if we're going to have cars or motorcycles, then vehicle. This vehicle will, will have um, a acceleration value, a velocity value, a turn rate, maybe wheels. And that those would be the information it stores. But also, we can add functionality here. We can call uh, ac uh, yeah accelerate we here can put turn the steering wheel brake i don't know maybe we have turbo in in our in our big vehicle right so the difference between information and functionality is this store values and functionality stores behavior like accelerating will increase the acceleration value this will increase the velocity value and also it will move physically our object right it was it will translate it to another position in this way we don't have to create this type of class more than once because once we create an object we can reuse it and the, the fact that it allows us to have hierarchies is that we can create a child of this object. We can create a, a child that is called a car. And in this car, we can define that the acceleration it will be, I don't know, this value, velocity will be, I don't know, 4, turn rate uh, 2.5, and the number of wheels will be we really don't need to define the accelerate turn the steering wheel because it will be used it it already already has been defined here we can override the methods here if we need for example maybe for the car being in turbo mode means that the wheels uh, spins faster then we could add some extra stuff right uh, if we change our mind and we don't need a car, maybe we need a, a, a motorcycle, then it's easy to just reuse this object and create a class and just set up the name and then define like only the stuff that will be different, right? Maybe I just want to change the wheels because I don't want an ATV, I want a, a two, two wheels only, right? And I put it here too. And everything will be exactly the same as the vehicle, only the wheels have changed to two. This means that these objects are allowed to be instanced and that these are that these instances are editable. This is why when we created two lights here, uh, where it is where is it? Lights, point lights. The class, the the class that is the parent of these two has all these attributes of intensity, light color, attenuation, radius, etc. But the instances here, again, we can change the color, uh, it won't affect the other instances. So that's a, a benefit uh, for, for when we are constructing functionality and where our level artists are creating more stuff here with blueprints, uh, because making one change will not affect the other changes.